Me and my mom are on our way to go pick up my Invisalign in Newport Beach. And I don't know how I feel about it. No, I don't really you. care if I'm in pain. I feel like people are over dramatic about it. Like I don't know how painful it could be. Like it doesn't seem like it would be that painful, if I'm being honest. But I'm not gonna put it in today. I'm just getting it today. I'm probably gonna put it in on Monday or tomorrow night. I don't know yet, but we're just picking it up now. That's all I have to say. Okay, so it is the next day and I'm about to have a face time call with my dentist in about 20 minutes. Basically, the dentist that I went to was my dad's dentist and my dad lives like a couple hours away from where I live. So, also the whole coronavirus thing. So we're just doing it over the phone, but I got my box yesterday. It's a long story, it's not really important though. But I'm just gonna show you guys what I got. We got this toothbrush. I got that, so this is probably gonna be for me to clean the clear liners, probably, I'm guessing because I already have a toothbrush, so. Then I got this bag filled with Listerine, chapstick, floss, and toothpaste. It's sensitive, because my teeth are gonna be sensitive. Okay. I'm actually, like, I'm getting nervous now because I keep hearing people saying how bad it hurts, but like, if, it weren't for me, then I would not be getting this because I've been asking this since I was probably in like seventh, sixth or seventh grade. I've been asking to get braces or Invisalign for so long. And like five years later, it's finally happening. So here's my box. I only have two trays right now. And I don't know what these are. I really don't, so we'll figure it out later. But here are my clear liners. My mouth is apparently really small. This is my first tray. Then here's my second one. Okay. Then we have the case right here, I guess. Which I kind of like it because it's neon green. So I love that for me. Yeah, that's everything that came in my box. So I just got off the call with my dentist and she told me some stuff. So. I took them out, but I'm not putting them in until later tonight because she said they're gonna be very tight, which I know that means that's it's gonna hurt really freaking bad. This is what they look like outside of the bag. Oh no. So they're in here. She told me to put them in right before you go to bed and then take some Aleve PM or something like that and then go to bed and then wake up and see what happens it might be really bad but basically these things are apparently so that you bite down apparently you're supposed to go like this and bite down on it so that the things go onto your teeth okay hi everyone i'm adding this into my vlog because i feel like i mean my video not my vlog um in my car right now and guess what i have to pee wait my look my look my skin look he looks bomb right now even anyways this is not about faces this is about teeth so i forgot to mention something so basically <laughs> i'm so happy because when i have these teeth in i only get to drink water <laughs> isn't that so exciting no it's really not so drinking my last coffee for probably eight ish months at the least am i excited about it hell no am i gonna do it anyway for the purpose of straight shiny straight beautiful straight not crooked straight teeth I kind of forgot what I asked myself, but I'm pretty sure the answer to what the question was is yes. I'm pretty sure that's what I for, kind of forgot what I was saying after talking to him. So I, I don't know what to expect. So they, everyone says I've been watching videos and I've been looking things up and everyone's like, it's a lot of pressure. They're really tight and it's sore and it's painful, but I don't know what kind of pain. 
it's gonna be also i'm on my phone right now so if the quality of audio is bad that is why i don't know also people always complain about if you're wondering about how they mold your teeth and they're like oh my god i couldn't breathe i choked on it blah, blah, blah. i did it and i was nervous about it because everyone hyped it up and i'm like you're joking that was literally the easiest thing i've ever done at the dentist not even joking when you get those little trays in your mouth with the little jelly stuff what's it called fluoride oh my god that's so much worse and it's not even choking you it just tastes so gross the mold over dramatic like if anybody has any tips and tricks or if something i'm saying is really wrong or if you want to help me out i wouldn't be mad about it i have one more hour left of freedom see it's nine o'clock and i'm i'm gonna start taking my advil and like i'm probably gonna take a leave pm so i just knock out i'm probably gonna start taking those at 9 45 kind of scared about it actually i'm really not scared at all i'm more excited i kind of want to put them in right now but i know that i will regret that decision but like i'm really excited actually i just want to put them in i'm so excited i don't know if it's weird to be showing you like my teeth <laughs> i don't really know if that's weird or not but guess what i don't really care <laughs> i don't really care because i think it's freaking cool this is only PM. It's gonna take away my pain and make me fall asleep. Now, I have to brush my teeth, floss my teeth. My booklet says to rinse these with cold water. Okay, it's time to insert. Once this is over, Oh my god. Mom. It is tight. <sighs> Please hold my hand. Ow. It's just really a lot of pressure. Okay, well that's, I guess so it's just pressure. Right now. How do I eat anything else? Oh, well, you, you. Oh uh, no, I have a lift. Lift. Oh no. Cass, it's fine. You, that, this is what you're gonna have to do. Did you take it? Did you swallow the leaf? No, I did it. Scared if it's gonna be that bad. Uh oh. I literally can't talk. Yes, you can. You're talking right now. <laughs> It doesn't hurt, it just feels very oh, weird. Yeah. It just feels very weird, like I'm eating something, like the thing, <laughs> right there. But I'm not in any pain so far. Who knows about later though. Also, 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 if people aren't commenting, I've taken out my Invisalign and this is the album, I'm deleting this video. I will in fact let you know let you know tomorrow morning because i'm gonna go to bed now last night was actually not that bad i got a lot more sleep than i thought i was gonna be able to get i only woke up like three times but then i went back to sleep i i was just like really anxious because um also i keep forgetting to mention that i don't actually have invisalign it's just like it's called clear correct it's not actually invisalign i didn't know that until i actually got it i thought it was invisalign the whole time uh but with invisalign you have to get like little things on your teeth um uh, like things to hold it in place but these like, are they really, like, you can't even tell. You can't even tell they're on my teeth. The only reason that you'd be able to tell is if you got, like, if you got, like, that close because you can kind of see, like, the top of it, how it's kind of, like, really shiny. But other than that, you can't tell. Another thing is also the lisp. So people are going to be like, why are you talking like that? Because I never had a lisp before. 
Hopefully I'll get used to it though. So I don't really know about Invisalign, but for me, I'm not in, it's not really painful. It's just really sore. It feels like my teeth went to the gym and worked out really hard. And then I woke up and it's sore. Like that's what it feels like. Um, so that's not really the part that's bothering me. The part that's bothering me is the lisp. And also, like, that part, the underneath part, I don't know how to explain it. Because my tongue, like, keeps touching the edges. Other than that, if I couldn't feel that. I wouldn't even know that they were in. Because my teeth are already really sensitive. I feel like it's just a normal day. It does feel like there's something on them, but it's gotten way better. I think I'm going to go try to eat breakfast right now. Um, I'm kind of scared because this is the part that everyone says really hurts when you take it out for the first time. So I have my overnight oats. They kind of look nasty, but um, they always taste good. So. And then I'm going to put a little bit of blueberries on it to see. Like, I don't know if it's going to hurt or not. This is the part that I'm scared for. <laughs> oh man. I my see teeth. My teeth, right? Oh, that was much easier. That does not feel the best. Okay, I take it back, it is painful. Just these two, that hurts so bad. Like, when I'm like this, it doesn't hurt. But like, if I touch it, it kinda hurts. Let's try eating it. It's mostly just my front teeth, and I don't even eat with my front teeth. Now I can talk, and I don't have a lisp. So, now I finished eating. It took me literally like 10 minutes, which is good because Oh man. So my dentist told me that for every hour that you have your trays out, it equals another day that you have to wear them, which obviously she doesn't know how long I have them out for. So it's just like she's kind of a, I guess, estimating. And after you eat, you have to brush, floss, and rinse your mouth. So that's what I'm doing now. Because I was eating peanut butter, I'm just gonna use this because I feel like it's still on my tongue and it could be in my teeth, I don't know. Because it peanut butter is sticky. So it's been three hours. It's been three hours hours I, can't talk. I don't know how much longer i'm gonna go on with this this um video because i feel like it's just gonna be really repetitive so right when i put them back in after i ate it was hurting so bad like oh my gosh but probably like 10 or 12 10 or 15 minutes after they kind of like settled it felt so much better and like right now it's not hurting at all it just i can feel it in my mouth you know to be honest it hurts more when they're off than when they're on they're just really sensitive especially my two front teeth like uh and i'm assuming that's because you don't really need to move your back teeth because you don't see it more the front teeth that are moving yeah i'm probably gonna have soup or something because i'm really hungry because usually i eat breakfast and then i have a small snack small snack and then i eat lunch but i'm not snacking anymore because i'm not about unless i'm like dying of starvation because i'm not about to brush my teeth every single time i eat so I think I'll just have to eat bigger meals probably. And I was thinking about doing like a what I eat in a day with Invisalign. But I don't know if that would be interesting or interesting or not. So if you guys want to see that, let me know because I could do it once I kind of get the hang of things. This lisp is supposed to go away in like three days. But if I'm being honest, I don't think it's going to go away. I made some soup. I made some soup. And I'm going to eat it. But first I have to take these out again, so let's see if it hurts even worse this time, or if it feels better. Okay. Oh, God. 
Yeah, it's like all the front teeth hurt. The back teeth don't really hurt. But let's see if this is good or not. Okay, I think I'm good. Mmm. Okay, honest, it's really not that bad. It's just like these two teeth, literally. And it's not like pain, it's just like sore. It's not the best feeling in the world, but it's also not the worst. I'll update you guys later today. And I'm sorry if I'm like low energy, it's just because I'm kind of like realizing that I have to go through this for eight months. And like right now, it feels like it's never gonna get any better. And like it feels like I'm always gonna be in this pain for like the, for like eight more months. And I'm always gonna feel it in my mouth and I'm never gonna get used to it. But I know that I am, at least I hope. So I'm just kind of like, blah. I've taken out my Invisalign. And this is the album. I just ate dinner and I'm gonna put these in. I didn't show it because I don't think anybody really cares what I was eating. And it would be like way too repetitive anyway, but I'm just putting them back in now. That is it. I'm not gonna eat anymore today because I don't wanna take them out again. Like I don't wanna keep taking them out. And it's six o'clock. So I think that's gonna be the end of this video because I don't have anything else to say. Thank you for watching. I hope this gave you some tips but i hope it kind of prepared you don't be scared you can do anything but it does i don't know thank you for watching and i will see you guys all again in my next video hey.